all right let's go we are still treating complex numbers now let's take this the nth root of unity the nth root of unity now we say that the special case in which z is equal to one just one just one z is equal to one so that is in this case we can find the nth root of unity okay now let's go you know in this case our r is going to give us one so we're going to have z is equal to one upper bracket then our theta is also going to give us zero so when you say tan inverse of zero is what zero okay it's going to give us zero so we're going to have cos zero plus i sine zero okay so that means we're going to have cos zero plus i sine zero okay we're going to have z is equal to cos zero plus i sine zero now in our root of complex numbers we have wk which is where k okay we have wk is equal to we have cos upper bracket theta plus 2k pi all over n plus bracket plus i sine theta plus 2k pi all over n okay so in this place now we have our theta to be zero so when you fix zero in this place we're going to have cos 2k pi all over n plus i sine 2k pi all over n hello so whenever we are asked to find any nth root of unity we're going to make use of this formula wk is equal to cos open bracket 2k pi all over n close bracket plus i sine 2k pi all over n okay yes this is what we're going to use this is what we're going to make use of okay now let's take for instance we have the question that says find the three third root of unity z equal to one okay z equal to one so in this case our r is going to give us square root of one square plus zero squared so zero squared is zero then one squared is one square root of one is one okay so we have r is equal to one and then our theta we have our theta to be tan inverse of zero all over one so we're going to have tan inverse of zero so tan inverse of zero is zero so our theta is equal to zero and then our r is equal to one so we have z is equal to one open bracket cos zero plus i sine zero all right let's go we are asked to find the three third root okay find the three third root of the unit okay now we're going to have one raised to power one all over three open bracket cos we have k times we have 2 pi 2 pi is 360 so we have k times 360 all over 3 plus i sine k times 360 all over 3 so we have we say where k is equal to 0 1 2 to n minus 1 okay now let's go we're gonna say this one raised to power 1 all over 3 is 1 so when 1 multiplied by everything it will not change nothing happens okay so we're going to have 360 divided by 3 is going to give us 120 okay so that means we're going to have cos k times 120 degrees plus i sine k times 120 degrees close bracket where k is equal to 0 1 2 3 t n minus 1 okay now we're going to find for k equal to 0, 1, 2. We have the three third root as follows. Okay? We're going to have where k is 0. That is w, 0. We're going to have cos 0 times 120. So I have our k to be what? 0. So we're going to have 0 times 120 plus i 
sine 0 times 120 so 0 times 120 is 0 so we're going to have cos 0 plus i sine 0 so cos 0 is equal to what 1 and then sine 0 is equal to 0 so 0 times i is 0 i so therefore we have 1 plus 0 i you can simply say 1 okay so now let's go where k is 1 we're going to have w1 is equal to cos 1 times 120 close the bracket plus i sine 1 times 120 so 1 times 120 is 120 so we're going to have cos 120 degrees plus i sine 120 degrees okay now let's go cos 120 degrees is going to give us minus 1 all over 2 then plus sine 120 degrees is going to give us root 3 all over 2 i okay going to have minus 1 all over 2 plus root 3 all over 2 i okay good let's go where k is equal to 2 we're going to have w2 is equal to upper bracket cos 2 times 120 close bracket plus i sine 2 times 120 so when you say 2 times 120 is going to give us 240 so we're going to have cos 240 plus i sine 240 okay yes so when you say cos 240 cos 240 is going to give you minus 1 all over 2 then when you say sine 240 sine 240 is going to give you minus root 3 all over 2 i okay so we have minus 1 all over 2 minus root 3 all over 2 i all right thank you very much please if you are new to our channel or you have not subscribed please just click the subscribe button to subscribe now please all right thank you